in this question we are given a pair of linear equations the given pair is kx plus 3y is equal to k minus 3 this is the first equation of the pair the second equation of this pair is 12x plus ky is equal to k and we are to find the value of k for which this pair of linear equations has no solution. Now let us compare this pair of linear equations with the general form of pair of linear equations. The general form of pair of linear equations has two general linear equations. The first equation is a1x plus b1y is equal to c1 and the second equation of general form of pair of linear equation is a2x plus b2y is equal to c2. Now on comparing the general form of pair of linear equations with given pair of linear equations we come to know that a1 is equal to k. We find that b1 is equal to 3 and c1 is equal to k minus 3. Further, a2 is equal to 12, b2 is equal to k and c2 is equal to k. Now, for a pair of linear equations having no solution, the condition is a1 upon a2 is equal to b1 upon b2 but they are not equal to c1 upon c2. On applying this condition to the given pair of linear equations, we will find that k upon 12 is equal to 3 upon k but they are not equal to k minus 3 upon k. We can understand it in three situations. In first situation, we will compare first two parts. The first part is k upon 12 and the second part is 3 upon k and they are equal. In second situation, we will take first part and third part. So k upon 12, the first part is not equal to third part that is k minus 3 upon k. Similarly, in third situation, we will consider second part which is not equal to third part. Okay, let us consider all situations one by one. In first situation, it is an equality. So, after cross multiplying, we will get k square is equal to 12 multiplied by 3 that is 36. k square is 36, it means k is equal to plus 6 or minus 6. So all possible values of k are minus 6 and plus 6. Now in second situation we have an inequality. Let us solve this in inequality. It is k square is not equal to 12 multiplied by whole k minus 3. So k square is not equal to 12k minus 36 or you can say k square minus 12k plus 36 is not equal to 0. We have transposed 12k and minus 36 from right hand side to the left hand side. So plus 12k is reduced to minus 12k and minus 36 has been turned into plus 36. So we have k square minus 12k plus 36 is not equal to 0. k square minus 12k plus 36 is a perfect square of k minus 6. So k minus 6 whole square is not equal to 0. Now this implies that k minus 6 is also not equal to 0. k minus 6 is not equal to 0. It means k is not equal to 6. So in second situation we find that k can take any value but not 6 okay now let us consider third situation third situation has another inequality solving it we will find 3k is not equal to k whole multiplied by k minus 3 
सो थ्री के इज नॉट इक्वल टू के स्क्वायर माइनस थ्री के वी कैन ट्रांसपोज थ्री के टू द राइट हैंड साइड एंड वी विल गेट जीरो इज नॉट इक्वल टू के स्क्वायर माइनस थ्री के माइनस थ्री के और जीरो इज नॉट इक्वल टू के स्क्वायर माइनस सिक्स के यू कैन राइट इट इन दिस वे ऑल्सो के स्क्वायर माइनस सिक्स के इज नॉट इक्वल टू जीरो नाउ के स्क्वायर एंड माइनस सिक्स के वी कैन टेक द टर्म के एज अ कॉमन टर्म एंड इन साइड द ब्रैकेट यू विल हैव के माइनस सिक्स सो वी विल हैव मल्टीप्लीकेशन ऑफ टू नंबर द फर्स्ट नंबर इज के एंड सेकेंड नंबर इज के माइनस सिक्स एंड वी कैन से दैट द मल्टीप्लीकेशन ऑफ दीज टू नंबर इज नॉट इक्वल टू जीरो नाउ मल्टीप्लीकेशन ऑफ टू नंबर is not equal to 0 it means none of these two numbers is equal to 0 so k is not equal to 0 as well as k minus 6 is not equal to 0 okay so k minus 6 is not equal to 0 it means k is not equal to 6 so k can take any values except 0 and 6 so k is not equal to 0 and k is not equal to 6 okay so after comparing all these situations see according to the first situation k is equal to 6 or minus 6 so k can take two values minus 6 and 6 according to the second situation k is not equal to 6 k cannot take value 6 and according to the third situation k cannot take value 0 and 6 so we see that value of k is minus 6 this value is satisfying all three situation situations so we can say that for the given pair of linear equations having no solution the value of k is minus 